it's me Sachita. Welcome back to the channel. I hope you all are doing absolutely fine. Today in this video, I'm going to talk about the NET exam. Yes, National Eligibility Test. This is the test most of the candidates who are trying to make their career as an assistant professor in the universities or colleges. They are looking for this exam. So we'll discuss about NET. What are the benefits? What is the eligibility? And I will share some of my personal tips. How I cleared my net exam. So let's start today's video. If you are new to the channel, do consider subscribing and press the bell icon so that you can get update regarding the new videos. I am making all the videos related to the career and are trying to add some value in your life. So let's start today's video. The first one we will discuss the two major benefits of this exam. The first one is if you are looking to make your career. teaching career as an assistant professor in any university college or maybe any engineering institution then you need to clear this exam first once you clear the net exam then you can apply you are eligible to apply for that particular post the second benefit is if you clear the net exam with some good uh, marks for example you are at the top cream layer of 50 to 100 candidates then you are eligible for the grf GRF means to say the Junior Research Fellowship. That is a fellowship. For example, you want to do uh, some research in your particular subject. You are a uh, English teacher. And you want to do. Uh, you are an English candidate, and you want to do your research in further literature or anything. Then, while doing that research with any university, you you will get paid for that. It's a uh, like you know fixed amount for the government, nearly about. Uh, uh like you know 1.25 lakh for 3 months you will get as a fellowship while you are working as a research in your that subject so there you will get benefits as a grf candidate by after clearing the net now let's talk about the validity of the exam if you clear the net exam then it will be valid for the whole lifetime you clear the exam and you are a net qualified candidate and you can apply to the assistant professor post in any like age or after as much years you are eligible uh, this one as certificate is valid for your whole life the second one is grf if you clear the grf means you are at the top cream layer of the candidates then it will be valid only for 2 years after for example you got the result today and you got the certificate in your hand today then after 2 years like till 2 years it will be valid within the 2 period a 2 year period of time you need to register yourself with any uh, fellowship program with any research program so that uh, you will get the benefits of the fellowship if you will exceed you will not able to register yourself within the two period of time two year period of time then you will not be able to get the benefits of grf now we reach to the eligibility criteria for this exam if you have cleared your master degree with 55% of marks then you can apply for this test or if you are a reserve candidate you are a, uh, like you know belong to a particular reserve category then maybe you will get some relaxation from that 55% but if you are in your final degree like final year of your degree still you can apply for the net exam you there is a option where you can uh, post that you can submit your result after the completion of the exam because you have not completed your master degree so you still can apply for this exam Now we'll come to the exam pattern and how you can apply for this exam. This exam government UGC is conducting a uh, two time in a year. Once is near around June. For that you need to apply in around January, and then uh, the second exam will be in December. And for that the mostly the uh, this uh, forms will be out around September October month. So you can check that on the website of UGC and CSIR. It depends. on your subject ugc and csir both are conducting the net exam so you can if you want i will uh, like you know put the description of both the website in the description box 
now we'll come to the exam pattern and how you can qualify that see exam pattern is different with the subject choice if you want i will make a separate video if you want to know about particular subject like you want to know about maths net exam uh, like you know uh, chemistry net exam or any physics or maybe any uh, like humanity economics any other subject so i'll make a detailed video about this if i talk about the general pattern then it will be your mcq exam totally based on the subject which you have taken you have done in your master degree but uh, there are certain portion which also included some reasoning question but are that that are also related to your your subject for example i am a chemistry candidate so i do have question from general science some questions which are related to the aptitude but are really linked to the science subject so it is totally a mcq based exam now the last section is how i clear my exam so my personal tips see i will suggest you best when you are doing your master degree this is the best time when you are really in touch with your subject so if you have a good subject knowledge of your subject where and uh, with which you are doing your master degree then it will be easy for you to clear the net so the best time is when you are uh, completing your master degree do apply for your uh, net exam during that also or just after completion of your degree other than that i think in my personal uh, opinion best is to do the self study for the exam do command with your subject try some aptitude question because there are several books available in the market which are uh, certified by ugc and csir so you go check and uh, many options are available i remember that upahar books publication are really books they were really helpful in my case other than that there are many sample papers the last year candidate they do share their questions uh, and uh, like you know certain book sellers or you can say the professional in this particular area they make do make our tentative paper how what kind of question were in the last exam so when you go to the market i know about delhi near jia sarai there is a huge market where you will get the last year uh, sample papers of the net exam do practice uh, do it uh, with the time management do self study have a command on your subject and believe me you'll be able to clear it easily so that's all for today's video if you do like the video and you have any question about the topic do let me know in the comment box i'll make sure that i'll reply to your queries and uh, for any other detailed video do put your suggestion what you want to hear in the coming videos on this note thank you have a nice day be safe be inside at home keep growing in your career bye bye